This program is supported by The Innertown Record, your weekly hometown community newspaper covering the Kearsarge, Sunapee, Sunshine region of New Hampshire. The Innertown Record. Welcome back. I'm Abby Peel, your host. Let's head down to Concord to hear about the League of New Hampshire Craftsmen. Thanks, Abby. I'm delighted to be here today with Peter Dish, the general manager of Vale Resorts at Mount Sunapee. Peter, how are you doing? Doing great. How are you today, Miriam? I'm really well, thanks. So we're uh, about to do the big event that we share and collaborate on every year, the 89th Annual Craftsman's Fair. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. You know. Uh, here at Mount Centipede, the team is so proud to be part of, you know, family traditions taking flight. And mm. I really can't think of anything else in New Hampshire that is more of a tradition than the Craftsman's Fair that's coming up here. And we're so proud and honored to be able to host such a, uh, an iconic event within the state and really throughout New England. Um, so really excited to welcome you and your team back. Thanks. Always been wonderful to work with. and. Hopefully we make you feel like you're at home. You sure do, and actually it's one of the things I'd love people to know in the area, like what a great collaboration this is. Uh, the League has an amazing team who produces this event, which is our you know, major event of the year. It's our big fundraiser, and we welcome over 20,000 people to this event so that we can support our incredible craftsmen and the beautiful work they do. And it's such a delight to have a partnership with an organization and a team such as yours that understands the mission, wants to be helpful in every possible way, and made a lot of advancements in the past year you know there's there's things that just make it look better but there's a can-do spirit of both of our teams that make this come together really well and it takes quite a long time doesn't it it does <laughs> I mean I feel like we just wrapped up last year's fair and maybe we took a break for maybe a day and we're already talking <laughs> about 2022 right and I just you know I've been getting more and more excited as we've rolled in closer and closer That's to the cool. event and you know there's an excitement as the grass greens up here uh, the tents start coming in, people start showing up, your team's here, and it goes by so quickly. It does. But it's so much fun. It is. Well, you get done with your major event called the ski season, and we start up our big <laughs> summer event, and we're off and running. So let's talk a little bit about what's new this year. Um, we always like to bring new ideas to the fair, so we're going to have amazing demonstrations. We're going to actually have a, um, um, a lot of children's events and family events that kids can do. Uh, excited about that. And, and I think you have a few new things to offer up as well. Yeah, so we're looking at trying out some new menu items. Oh, great. Um, so, you know, we work with some other food vendors here at the fair, but uh, the Mountain also uh, hosts food down the Spruce Lodge and up in the Centipede Lodge. Um, so we're looking at doing some different, fresh, uh, different menu items to, you know, maybe be a little more reflective of the New Hampshire community of what you can to expect. You might see a lobster roll, might see some clothes. Ooh. We'll see. <laughs> I love the fact that we get surprised by what you and your team are going to do every year, so that's great. We, of course, bring in food vendors as well, but we really work hard to give a nice balance because we want to be respectful of your offerings and appreciate that your team is always interested in bringing new ideas forward. So thanks for leading the charge on that. Um, one of my things I'm most excited about is I've wanted a scavenger hunt here for kids for years and we're finally doing it this year so that's a big new event and um, our artists tell us that they are working hard last year was a banner year for the makers um, we sold over 2.75 million dollars worth of crafts through the booth holders alone incredible. Uh, and our galleries have been doing well this year so we feel really supported by the New Hampshire community you know I think they're supporting local artists lo local makers and um, local businesses such as this mm -hmm. well craftsmen are such an important piece of that you know I think seeing the passion and the excitement that good craft can bring to people both the people making it the, the energy and excitement they put into it the experience that they they put into crafting that and then the people that come here to explore it you know it's it's an incredible event I and mean, you can spend hours walking around and find that item that that connects with you and you're connecting with that person that made it they put their their hard work they put their personality into mm -hmm. and I think it's just a great depiction of what our community uh, is is passionate about is, is this fair and the the craftsmen that are, are putting out these incredible pieces of art I agree with you we have such a following in this region um, who appreciate us many of our donors are here it's just been a legacy and of course we've been at um, Mount Sunapee with different partners originally the state and then Triple Peaks and now Vale 
uh, owners of the lease and uh, we're grateful for the partnership and also the appreciation that we bring um, a lot to the creative economy of the state by coming here we help the local businesses um, we're supported by the local businesses it's all good but um, the relationship that we've had with the lease owners of this mountain and you specifically now through Vale is really welcomed and so appreciated by all of the league members our board etc so thanks again for hosting us we look forward to seeing all of you at the 89th Annual Craftsman's Fair. For more information, go to nhcrafts.org, and the dates of the event are August 6th through 14th. Once again, nhcrafts.org, August 6th through 14th.